Hi guys, it's Sorcerer Clay Fab 2. This was requested by All About Briars. Um, so this is a briar review on the Ricky Rocker and Partly Cloudy. So we'll start off with Partly Cloudy. We'll start off with her legs and hooves. So she does have frogs. And she do her hooves actually do have shading. Um, you probably can't see that, but they do. She has stockings and one sock. Then her shading. She has shading on her knees and then they go to a grayish color. Then you have her coat color, which is a gray, double gray pinto. And she does have dapples, very lovely dapples. Her shading is very, very um, not subtle, like very, like it's way darker over here, and then it gets like mapping almost, and then it's very pretty. So she has a marking there, and then you have her face. Her face is very dished, as an Arabian should be. I'm not entirely sure if an Arabian can be this coat color, um, but I made her an Arabian. Um, weather girl. So she has shading on her muzzle as well. And her eyes are very detailed. They have white rimmed and white rimmed on that eye as well. Her face is very delicate and pretty looking. Please excuse that noise, that's my dog. Um, so she has one ear back and one ear forward, very pretty. Her forelock is wrapped around her ears. And her mane is flowing as she is running. And then she has dapples on the side as well. She has a wonderful tail that has volume, I guess you could say, and it's shading as well because it goes down to white. Nothing really wrong with her, other than the fact that she can get, um, this mold is, sorry, I should actually turn it this way, um, sorry about that. This mold is actually really prone to warped legs. Um, this model actually did have warped legs as to the point where she would not stand on, even on hard floors like this, she would not stand. Um, I had to fix her, and I did, but, um, she still won't stand on carpet, so I'm going to try to fix that again, and I could do a tutorial on that if you'd like, because that is something she is prone to, uh, or any horse on this mold. Another thing is if you're trying to put the briar saddle on her, um, like, if for realistic pictures or whatever, um, it gets caught up on the mane right here, because the saddle should be going, like, right here. So it has to go underneath the mane. Um, unless you put it like back here. So that can also be an issue with her. Um, but she's actually just a um, shelf model of mine. I don't use her that much. Um, except for videos and barn tours and stuff. So it's not a problem for me. Um, yeah, so she's really pretty. Um, she's my second favorite mold. She has tons of shading and I love how her neck is arched. Other than that, she has no other issues, um, at least my model doesn't, so now we'll move on to Little Ricky Rocker. This is Little Ricky Rocker, um, after the real Abby. So, if we look at his hooves, we'll start again at the hooves. He has shaded and striped hooves. He does not have frogs, um, partly Claudia does. He has, like, brown little startings, I guess, I don't know what you call them really. Um, and then he has spots all over. He does not have much shading, as, um, do most white briar horses. They don't have many shading, or much shading. Um, the only spot on him that really has shading is his face and muzzle, so. Yeah, and he has very detailed spots. Super, super detailed eyes. Probably can't see that. His ears are brown. And they actually make him look really cute. And he is supposed to have those white spots right there by his nose. You can probably see those. And there is a lighter and darker variation of him. Um, I have the lighter, I believe. Um, basically, the lighter and darker are the same body and all that. It's just the shading on the muzzle is darker or lighter. That's basically the only variation there is. Um, <clears throat> so his tail is very broad. And his mane is 
doesn't have he doesn't have mane on that side only on this side and it's like i believe it's a roach clip and he has a spot of brown on his mane which he is supposed to have um flaws that you should look out for you're probably going to want to get the darker variation of his shading as well as try to get none with smudged spots mine has tons um right there those are actually smudged uh he has one on his shoulder and then he has some other smudged spots on the other side um the only reason i bought him uh i saw the smudged spots in his box and i didn't want to buy him because of that but he was the only one they had left um so i decided to get him but the smudged spots really make him not lsq um so i'd recommend watching out for the smudge spots anyways um thanks for watching this has been a review on partly cloudy and literary, literary rocker if you'd like some more reviews comment below and i'd be more than happy to give you guys any as well as i totally recommend getting either of them the, um literary rock is actually my favorite model and partly cloudy is my second so thanks for watching bye